Hello guys, I know you are stressed. Okay, so here are some stress busters, mind massage, happiness tablets, and whatever you want to call them. Actually, this is just a collection of some answers that I have prepared for you. If you face the question, why IT sector when you are from the core branch? I know many of you can write your own answers. All the best if you can do that because nothing's better than an original answer because you will be very comfortable speaking that and saying that. But in case you are not able to write or come up with a valued, uh, valuable expression instead, so here are some tips, okay? Five answers that you can summarize. I can say mug up and then speak up. Will you do that? Because Speak Up India asks you to do that. Okay, the first reason is basically I want to get a job, I want to get paid, I want salary. That's why IT sector. Otherwise, I have to put my lab record on my hand and say, no, it's not going to be a programmer. I have to be a programmer, so what can you say in support of your aspiration? First answer. Sir, as a civil engineer, I have been trained to look for solutions to problems of my own core domain. Three years of classes, labs, projects, and trainings have enriched me with the capability to analyze, strategize, and suggest solutions. Though the other aspects appear to have changed, the core competency within me remains the same. Now, if an IT major feels that my analytical and aptitude for solutions can be harnessed, for their sector, I'm ready to work for them. One. Okay, let's go to the second answer. I know, sounds a bit cheesy. You can change the language somewhat and get back to a better one. Second answer. Why do you want to join the IT sector when you are from an electrical background? So today, the fastest growing sector with capacity to absorb the largest number of employable engineers is the software industry. So whether it is the multiple channels of growth after the entry level, or the speed with which a fresher like me can climb the heights of a professional career, only the IT sector can provide that. And as an aspiring and eligible candidate, my future appears to be most secure to me here in your company. And this means I will work without worries and deliver my best. Hi, re, bhakti, vare, fandom, IT sector ka chaska. Okay, this is the third answer. Uh, of course, we can say that uh, even ladies are going to interview you. So a little respect for them as well. In fact, a massive respect, but you guys don't do that. So I'll have to insert it here. All right. So what's the answer? Why do you want to join the IT sector? Ma'am, I have always been a very active person, both in academics and outside the class. I would like to continue this trend of wholesome, holistic living. This is not provided in core sector, which are very traditional and narrow minded. When there is a platform to display your true potential in work, fun, and creativity, that becomes my ideal job site. So the IT industry with its numerous trainings, CSRs, competitions, fun sessions, and annual activities is a big magnet for an engineer like me. I want to do but I will not So please give me a chance. Dijiye. Fourth answer. Why do you want to become an IT sector employee? Ma'am, I believe that I can perform best when I'm surrounded by productive and professional people. Today, the best talent is being recruited by the IT companies for their operations. Bright minds and motivated graduates find the software sector to be fascinating and head for such destinations in great numbers, thus making it my first choice of offering my skills and knowledge for hire. I love intellectual people. I love intelligent people. Hence your company. Why do you want to join the IT industry being from an electronics background? Sir, as an electronics engineer, I'm already acquainted with the domain knowledge of that stream. Added to that is the basic programming skill set with me to get me started with entry level positions. With a little bit of training, you will find me handling the clients with interest or business related to my discipline and designing and delivering IT solutions with very fair results. I'm a very good fit for such kind of a position. So when you hire me, you are actually hiring two engineers, one, a core or a circuit engineer, and also an IT engineer. Triple E people, you have the advantage of saying you're, you're hiring three people, not even triple E, because the CSCE, CSSC, ECS, E and I, and you can also say uh, aeronautical, mechatronics, 
प्लस मैकेनिकल प्लस आईटी सब बोनस पे बोनस सोने पे सुहागा सो दीज आर सम ऑफ द फ्यू एरियाज दैट यू कैन कम अप विद इन शॉर्ट इन टर्म्स ऑफ योर आंसर ओके हियर आर टू बोनस आंसर्स टू द सेम क्वेश्चन दैट वी हैव जस्ट डिस्कस्ड यू कैन यूज देम एज वेल लेट्स से समवन आस्क लाइक व्हाई डू यू वांट टू जॉइन द आईटी सेक्टर बीइंग फ्रॉम अ कोर सेक्टर बैकग्राउंड Ma'am, it really sounds strange that a core sector person like me would like to join the IT sector, but it is totally normal for me because multiple batches of my seniors have shown their capability and strength in the IT sector. Many of my seniors who were good uh, students in civil engineering, they had great scores, eight point five. cgpa and above they are doing absolutely great in the it sector i am in touch with them some of them are working in your company as well and they say that the core competency is the one that works for them and they have reported that they enjoy working there it's not like they're forced to do that so i think that sharing the same characteristics same kind of traits like my seniors i too will enjoy and perform like them if i join your company ma'am ma'am obviously if you have selected me for this interview it means that you trust my branch you trust my domain to produce individuals who can be trained and mentored and prepared to become a very good it professionals whether as a tester as a developer as a programmer as a designer whatever but trainability is i the thing that works for us so being a mechanical engineer i'm already a design freak design enthusiast so if i join your company i'm assured that you will be giving me real great tips to suit myself to the uh, the project or the task at hand and i'll prove myself to be a very good professional it professional so these are some of the answers that i prepared for you five normal answers and two kind of a little bit hatke answers because some of you can actually put it off so see if it can suit you leave your questions in the comment section below and i'll try to answer them in the next video all the best